Greetings viewers, ETCG1 here. How the heck are you? I also have a channel called Eric the Car Guy. Repair stuff happens over there, linked in the description. Hey, if it's your birthday, happy birthday, and thank you for tuning in. I don't wanna take a whole lot of time with this video. I've been working all day and I'm dirty. Staying dirty. But I wanna talk a little bit about uh, deadlines and why they suck and why they're important. Dad's trucks behind me, the engine and transmission are finally installed. It's May 16th, uh, 2019. Happens to be my oldest son's 29th birthday. Happy birthday, Paige. So yesterday I came in and was working and I fell behind. There were some things with the assembly of the engine. Mainly I was like sanding down the cam button trying to get the clearance or the, the cam uh, end play. I was trying to set the cam end play and I got a nylon button on the front of the cam and you have to set it and I, anyway. That set me back along with a few other little minor BS things that happened during the day. And that put me behind on my deadline because I wanted to have the engine and transmission in yesterday. I was getting so close. I'm like, ugh. But today I came in early and I, I just started kicking butt and now I'm back to where I wanted to be yesterday. So here we are, next day, and, it, and it's kind of like I'm a day behind. But that's okay because, like for me, this was the big thing. I needed to get the engine and transmission in the truck. That, that was something that had to happen because the rest of the stuff all happens just in the engine compartment. All the other work that I've done behind the scenes and everything, all that comes together now. All that you know, other work that I did should be plug and play at this point. And if it is, awesome. And, and I'm hoping for that. But I just... You know, I, I have a love-hate relationship with deadlines because if I didn't have a deadline on this, how long would I drag it out? Probably a lot longer than I am. You know, I, I'd probably keep moving the bar well, like I am now. I'm moving the bar now because, like I said, I'm a quote-unquote day behind as far as where I'm at. But I just think without a deadline, it's, it's like an open-ended thing and it may never get done. And in fact, I know people that are into projects that they've had going on for years and years, and, and a lot of that could be finances, but I also think that it's no deadline. And without a deadline, it's like you're just sort of drifting, and you're like, ah, I'll get to that when I get to it. But a deadline's like, get it done now. So that adds a whole different kind of stress. <laughs> Without a deadline, it may never get done. With a deadline, it may stress you out and may lead you to an early grave. <laughs> I don't know. But I, I was curious what you think about it. I mean, deadline, no deadline. I, do, you, do you like setting a deadline for yourself and saying, okay, by this day, I need to have this done? Or is that, you know, is it your schedule? Because for me, the reason why I'm on such a tight deadline is because I got a schedule. I'm, be, I'm not gonna be here. I'll be driving around the country, hopefully meeting you. So uh, I'll link in the description my car source schedule. So if you're around these cities that I'm going to, including the one on the power tour, you can come and see this truck, me and my dad. I'll bring the Fairmont. He's bringing the truck. That's the whole point of all this. So that's the reason why my deadline's my deadline. But back to you, do you set deadlines for yourself? And if you don't set deadlines for yourself, do you find yourself just sort of meandering on and on and on and never getting things done? So deadlines, they, they suck and you, you stress yourself out or do you not have one and see what happens. What's it like for you? Uh, I'll put links in the description to other stuff. If you have automotive questions, I ask you to head to ericthecarguy.com. That will also be linked in the description. I want to thank you for watching and please like, comment, subscribe. I really appreciate that. Be safe, have fun, stay dirty, and I will see you next time. Yes, I'm in a good mood because the truck engine transmission is in.